Welcome to Flanuary! It's Flanuary, which for me is vlogging during the month of January. Before we get started on this journey together, I thought I'd go ahead and just tell you guys what I'm thinking. I'm not going to promise every day during January. What I'm kind of thinking is that I'll look at a week and then I might get like three or four days that I document for you guys and put it into three or four videos. So not all seven days of every week will have new videos, but I really do want to kind of try to document this month of January for you guys and just kind of create a little bit of a community here on Be Joan Style channel and I thought it was kind of a cool New Year's resolution and the month of January is always about new and fresh and starting over and starting you know like challenging yourself and giving yourself goals and so for me one of my goals is to do this January to vlog as much as I can during the month of January. Today is all about hitting refresh on uh, Fit and Fabulous. Let's just say I took a uh, nice long three week break. It's time to start over and I actually haven't even been to the gym in a few weeks either. So I am headed right now to the gym. I'm gonna be uh, starting my workouts again, getting back into that routine. And also today I'm going to be working on food prepping. So I'm going to do the month of January, a 21 day challenge that a friend of mine has set up for me. She's kind of a fitness expert, fitness and health expert. And she has like a 21 day detox plan. So it's definitely a little bit more of an extreme way of eating. And I don't uh, eat this way in the everyday life, but it's kind of a good way to refresh. It's good. It just kind of resets. It's almost like doing Whole30 or something like that, if you guys have heard of that, or Paleo. I'll be sharing with you guys uh, that whole process. So grocery shopping, prepping the meals for the week, how I do that, all that kind of stuff. So today is just really going to be about that. Also, I will let you know kind of what I've been doing in the gym. I'm a little strange when I'm in there. I go to 24 hour fitness, um, but I actually do a workout video from my phone. I do Tracy Anderson's mat workout. It slims me out like no other workout. So I'm actually really strange in the gym because I put up my phone somewhere and I work out from my phone, which I could do that from home, I know. But with two kids and life and everything, I can't do that. And when I'm in the gym, I'm way more focused. So. It is pretty funny. I think people look at me like, what is this girl doing? Because it is also a slightly strange workout. It's not the typical using weights and doing squats and lunges. She does all kinds of weird like arm things and stuff like that. All right, so I am gonna head into the gym. I might try to film a little bit while I'm in there so you guys can see how crazy I look. Was way harder than it normally is because I've taken so many weeks off so my butt is killing me. Decided to kick off more goodness with a green juice so I'm headed into Nectar. It's hilarious it's New Year's observed day so I feel like everyone's still not in the mood to start life yet. Everyone has on their Uggs and their big puffy coats. I just couldn't do it again. I was so sloth-like the last few days that I decided today is the day to refresh my life. By the way, I got the toxin flush, so supposedly it's supposed to make my tummy feel good and clean me out, which TMI, but I definitely need a good toxin flush if you know what I'm saying. I'm gonna hop on the computer and print out the 21-day plan that I'm doing. Print it out, get my grocery shopping list, and I'll be heading to the grocery store to get all that stuff. So 
So just so you kind of know what I do, basically I cook up some of the chicken and also cut up some of the veggies and then the other stuff I kind of just leave for the meals. And right here I keep um, my schedule of what I'm eating. So I have five meals that I eat a day, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and then there's snacks in between. So I've got like every single day what I'm supposed to eat and that just keeps me on track and I keep it on my fridge. I will start prepping the food now. and I'm in my room now you might notice something a little different and that is I don't have a bed anymore we have a mattress but we don't have a bed anymore we sold it on Craigslist a funny story is it's an anthropology bed with a great beautiful canopy on top our ceiling is too low in our room here at our house there's really no point in having that beautiful canopy bed when we can't actually use it that way we sold the bed on Craigslist with the hope of finding a new bed and I'm hoping that's part of January is me finding a new bed and kind of redoing my room back to the theme of hitting refresh um that is what today has really been all about as you can see I didn't get dressed today I just wore my workout clothes all day and I don't know if you guys ever have your days like that I pretty much feel like a lot of Mondays I don't really hardly get dressed I just wear workout clothes all day because I work out and then I feel like I'm just kind of grinding it out and getting things done and getting the rest of the week set up and that is what I'm doing today. Another thing I'm hoping to refresh and also share with you guys during the month of January is my skin. Oh, my skin has been really bad lately and I'm hoping a few things were contributing to it being bad and that is um, the stuff that I use for my skin I ran out of and I'm waiting for it to come in the mail so it should be coming any day now and also probably all the food I was eating <laughs> wasn't good for my internal uh, processing and what was coming out on my face. So I'm hoping to share with you guys just the process that I go through to get my skin a little bit better. I. I've always dealt with my skin, it's always been an issue, but it, it has gotten a little bit better recently or in this last year and due to a product, I think, to a product that I'm using which is crude, it's called crude oil and I will share it with you guys when it comes in the mail, but it's basically just doing oil pulling with your skin cleansing with an oil and that's it and that is all I've been doing. I don't even use anti-aging products or anything because I do have such bad skin that I'm always scared something's going to make it worse. So I'm hoping that this month I'll be able to share with you that crude is what makes my skin better and we will really find out because it's bad right now. I'm going to start using it. I haven't been using it in maybe like a week and I'm hoping that the minute I start using it it'll get better and I can share that with you guys. Also just looking at my month, I'll share with you guys, I'm a huge calendar girl. I love paper and calendars and I like a big one like this and I just got this one at Target. I love every month to have a big section like this where I can write what's happening every month. And then for the weeks, I like it to be kind of like this where every day there's a big section to write what I need to do. And then also I keep a notebook with me at all times. And this is my just everything notebook. It, this has things I need to get done and lists that I make. It has um, kind of goals in it. It has, um, if I listen to somebody and I hear like good tips on YouTube or something like that, I'll write notes down. It'll have outfit ideas. It kind of has everything in it. So like here you guys are today, January, talking about what I want to talk about today, that kind of stuff. So I always have my calendar and my big notebook. I don't put anything in my phone in terms of like calendar. I really should because I do know it's nice to kind of like look when you're on the go, what do I have tomorrow, but I like my calendar and I can kind of see it in my head and I like that. Please leave comments below with questions. I love to just kind of be answering things along the way. I think that's where I'm going to end today is just with the whole idea of refreshing, starting over today, eating well, prepping all my food, working out again, looking at my calendar and kind of planning out my month and my week. So I will see you guys pretty soon. Bye.